you know, I grew up in the barrio and I, uh, I want to reflect that, you know, because that's who I am and that's what art schools told us to do and that's what I'm going to do. And I come from a certain kind of background, poverty, okay? There's many visual and real components of poverty that have to do with broken down bed springs and rusted this and trash here, okay? I want to change that. Okay, I don't think that's the only image to represent Chicano, but I think that is a legitimate one. And I'm saying that we have to manifest a lot of the things as we see them, not how other people want to interpret them. If you slow down, it drips. So you have to be quick and it's fast. For that reason, you can get things up very quickly. Uh, it really helps, though, and really requires that, that you have a, a certain kind of dexterity with a spray can. And that's, that's uh, something that, in many instances, people underrate graffiti. They don't really recognize the, the calligraphy involved. Specifically, I'm trying to reflect Chicano lifestyle, um, indicate that we have some pride, uh, expand the awareness of what our culture means. It's hard to read. Does it make your eyes yeah. jump around? Yeah. Good. I'll leave it like that. It'll be like a neon sign. Mm -hmm. In Spanish, what do you want?